You have them all right there. Why? I get, got you a stool. It's not a fucking secret, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I guess that's our intro. But anyway, this is the fun little idea <laughs> we're going to have. Intro? That's the intro. Okay, whatever. Do your thing. <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to have a little fun ranking the co-op games that the three of us have played so lucky, far this year. Lucky number 13. 13. 13. Of them. I don't think this is going to be fun. <laughs> I really don't think this is going to be Somebody's going to have fun. <laughs> the viewers. So we have a big whiteboard down just below the camera. So you yeah. see my eyes wandering down there. I'm not looking at your crotch, sir. I'm looking at the numbers <laughs> on the board. I'm looking at your crotch. <laughs> and we've got them on the board numbered in the order that, that we, we played, played them. them. So what we're going to do is we're going to start at the top. We'll work our way down. We'll see where we would put it in the uh, order of enjoyment that we like. Yeah. You know what? We should have done. Drink instead? No, no, no. <laughs> is instead of writing them down because we're going to be erasing it, oh, we yeah. should have had it on a piece of paper, cut them, and then you can move them around. Ah, so then oh, it's yeah. This is magnetic, too. No, Whatever. It's, that's not it's this magnetic. This is magnetic? Is it? Yes! Well, do you want to go make yourself some printouts? Fuck no! All right, we're going to do dry erase marker. Can I have the eraser at least? So I'm going to use my hands. Well, it's probably easier yeah, once oh. we once we go down our list, we, we can probably say the shit games first and hover them down at the bottom. Okay. So as if Jim there was, are shit games. Jim was in a big huff there because I had the games. You can see the games and it's not a secret. So what <laughs> I'm going to do is I'm going to name them off. All the way down to 13, so everybody knows what's on the board. Then I want us to see if we can pick the obvious worst game. Okay. Yeah. Then That's we'll we yes. then we'll work down the list and then we'll yeah, try yeah, to yeah. figure it yeah. out. Okay. okay. I'm already ready to fight with you. <laughs> <laughs> no, let's do I, the best. I first. woke up this morning ready to fight with you. <laughs> All right. Number one on the board, the devil in me. That would be. Burp, burp, burp. Well, I'm actually not going to do all that. That's going to take too much time. Then why do we number, even take the games? I'll show them when we're doing this part. Okay. Wait, okay, number give two. me the games, and when you say them, I will hand them off. All right, sure. They're not all there because we got some. They're not ones. all there. Neither am I. <laughs> neither uh, me. Neither am I. Neither me. Devil in me. All right, Little Hope is number two. Little Hope. <laughs> Little Hope. Cuphead is number three. Cuphead. Uh, Jen, you didn't spell that right. Medan, me, Medan. <laughs> it's Man of Medan. Man of Medan. But Jim put Medan of Medan. <laughs> Good start. Warhammer Chaos Bane. It's Scott on the cover. Yeah, it is Scott on the cover. That guy's slightly I need, taller. I need a bet. Fuck you. I thought you'd be bigger. <laughs> That's what my wife said. <laughs> I need a better beard and some hair in the middle in order to pull that look yeah, off. Yeah, you do. Uh, hunt down. Hunt down. Overcooked. No, that's a digital one. Digital game. Digital game. Sorry, folks. <laughs> Why did you try to look for it? Marvel Ultimate Alliance three. D and D Heroes. That's Dungeons and Dragons Heroes. Yes. Hidden Agenda. Mmm. Mmm. Trinity Trigger. Mmm. Uh. Uh. Overcooked. <laughs> Part de. That's not how yeah. <laughs> Number two. It's a Canadian game. <laughs> and guns, gore, and cannoli. And special shout out to Joey for uh, telling us about it. Yes. Yeah. Out of more, Joey. That's You're my fucking eraser. That. That's your fucking eraser? Okay, let's skip past that then. Mm. <laughs> Doesn't smell like it. <laughs> I'm not cutting any of this video down. I'm just Ah, uh, uh, bullshit. All right. I'm not. What's the obvious number 13? Anybody want to start this fight? I'm kind of leaning Hidden Agenda. Because that was sad. It didn't... I don't know. It just, it's it... either that or Overcooked 2. Oh, I, I would put those Overcooked 12 and 13. <laughs> I like <laughs> Overcooked! <me> off. <laughs> I like the first one better than the second one. <laughs> Only because it was a little more challenging and it was something different. It was the first time playing it. And then we went from number one right into number two and it was like, I just fucking played this game. But the, the thing is, I I don't want to say that I hated Overcooked. I just hated the people I just I played hated it. <laughs> <laughs> I hated, I hated it when we couldn't get on the same page. 
And that's you what You should have got up fun. and did your, your, your little... whole presentation. <laughs> <laughs> what do they call puberty? those? A TED Talk? Yeah. Or yeah. <laughs> did a TED Talk, yep. But tomatoes, top, I mean, top we tomatoes. Top <laughs> tomatoes. <laughs> But we had fun playing it. Oh, I yeah. mean, we had we had nights. way more fun on, on the first game. We were in tears a couple what of times, I... laughing. The second game was a lot easier. Yes. And like it was, it was repetitive. We should have waited. We probably should have waited. Yeah. Why don't we do that then? Maybe we'll, we're gonna put Overcooked Two as our least favorite. Oh, I didn't say that. I said Hidden Agenda. Uh, Hidden Agenda, I didn't care much for. We didn't get a good ending. It was maybe that. But I would like not to play very through it again. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know Is what I mean? I would like to play through it again. Okay. With okay. With the same group. You don't want to play Overcooked Two again? No, I'm done with that. <laughs> okay. So I am <laughs> done with. I am overdone with Overcooked. I can agree with that. That uh, I do have aspirations to play Hidden Agenda again to see if we could get a better ending and see if the game. Which could means. Be so it wasn't just, that bad. So did we just come up with 13 and 12 right off the bat? Arguing those two? Well now, 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 now I'm wondering if Hidden Agenda is higher on the list. Well, Overcooked 2 can be the bottom. Overcooked 2. Alright, but uh, they're still fun to play. Yeah. Are you arguing against yourself in this I place? am. <laughs> they're fun to play, but Jesus, I hate them. <laughs> Like, like, does that make sense? It's like women, you love them, but I hate them. Yeah. <laughs> like, I would never play by myself. <laughs> mm. <laughs> well, I do play by myself, but not overcooked. So, uh, it'll, the official skid mark of our 13 <laughs> list is overcooked. Well, it, but it's just because. Are you arguing with No, no, no. I'm <laughs> saying why. I'm saying why. It is still fun, but it's just the replayability. I would not play it again. Yeah, it's okay. kind of a one and done. It's a one and done. Yeah. If you look at me in a couple years now, I see. We should you know play Overcooked. <laughs> look, they released Overcooked 3. Oh, we will probably play we'd it. We'd probably play it. But you All guys, right. you don't feel like that about the baseball but game. But let's, let's agree more. here. To disagree. I don't think there's not a bad game on this list. We just said what? No. Well, that is the worst, <laughs> the worst of what game. we like. It's yeah. not saying that we disliked yeah. it. No, I, it. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. They were all fun. You just said you disliked it. <laughs> I hate it the most of these games, <laughs> but I don't hate it. Okay. We're, okay, that's, that's the worst of this list. <laughs> but it's still good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this, this, this is right. messed up. Okay, grab, grab uh, the devil in me. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the top of our list. But see, there's okay. Wait. No, so you're just gonna grab them all at the same time? Yes, because. But they're not all kind of created at the same time. Yeah. Well, the other one we didn't finish because it was. Yeah. The obvious okay. First one. So there's it's a series, right? Oh, that's not gonna stand up. I love that you think about. But I'm just gonna do this. Okay. You go ahead. Are we putting all these in the number right now? Like, well, I just I don't remember what was what. <laughs> Oh, good. The little, okay, the devil in me was, now you got me fucking, yes. <laughs> now you got me confused. That's man, I'm a dead, I'm a dead, I'm a dead. The devil in me. The devil in me, is that the one that was going back in time? No, that's in the big mansion. Yeah, that's in the big mansion. Like, kind of like a serial killer thing going on. Almost I felt like Saw, right? Yeah, because that's the newest of them, right? Yeah. Yeah. I, you know I think out of those three, that might be my least favorite. I, it might be my least favorite too. It would be Devil in Me, Man of the Den, Little Hope. Like, okay, but where me, would you put Devil in Me on this list? Mm. Like to me, these three games might be the bang bang bang. No. 10, 11, 12. You no. put Hidden Agenda over all Hidden those? Agenda. Oh, true. <laughs> Warhammer Chaos Bane. What? We, we, we had fun with that. It got real repetitive at the end, and it was the same enemy. Which one is that one? That that's that PS5 one. Game. See, my problem is Dungeon and D and D Heroes was awesome. How come I can't find it? Well, I'm getting off had track. It right there. Oh, this one. I know. Why are we on Chaos Bane? I it's don't just, know. The, we're at, okay, the devil. The in devil me. in me. Give it a number right now. Which one was it? <laughs> the one in the mansion. The one. Oh. In the 
Mansion! Lennon the Mansion! No, I don't know why. Stop put, put all that stuff away. Why do we have all these games? I don't know. We're talking about this one. Okay. Where would you put that on the list of... It's somewhere is there. 10, 11, or 12. I was thinking... Uh, is it in my... 11. 11? So what's worse than Devil in Me? Hidden Agenda. For uh, me. Because of the experience. I can't base a game on its playability later. Like, I don't know if the experience will be better. I'm assuming it will be. We'll get a better ending. You know what? For the purposes of this, that's how I feel about it at this moment. I don't, I don't mind that, be having... I'm in that scene. Uh, I don't mind having, uh, what's that game? Hidden Agenda. Hidden Agenda there, number 12. 12. Are we just working our way backwards? Is it really I think so. Going okay. Going that way. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cause we all agree the, the thing was, it Hidden was agenda. good. Yeah. yeah. Like we... Yeah. But is it, you know a, is I, it a real fun game the, to play? No, and like the, the, and the, the... We had five of us playing this game. And, yeah. And the, the mood, the atmosphere in the room was... Pretty like low. people were on it the was, phones. It was pretty boring there. It was not really yeah. capturing it. And and I don't know like, if it was all our choices that we made or if it's just that's just the speed of the game. It was yeah, kind of a murder mystery feel to it. it wasn't yeah, gross. I feel good with that. It didn't yeah. have a lot of. There was not a lot of intensity. There was not a lot well, of like. I would then put suspense. I think I would put the devil in me. Number eleven. Number eleven. Okay, Dennis, you're fine with that. Uh, sure. <laughs> Why don't you argue with me about it in five minutes? <laughs> no, I, because I find that all these three could all be all But I, I found we had a lot of fun with Little Hope. That's next, so let's talk about that next. Yeah. We Little did Hope have fun next. with that one. I... That one started out in a house, and remember there was a fire? Oh, there was a fire. This is all, yeah. This one had a much better story than the Men of Medan. Yeah, and the jump scares in it were good. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I probably shit myself a couple times. Yeah. Just like that. You know what? Like, I enjoyed Little Hope more than Man of the Day. Definitely. So it's not going in the 10 spot for sure. And would I pick something else that I enjoyed would, better on that list? So Chaos Bane, would you put it be number 10? I like Chaos Bane. Better than... Better Ch than... Little Hope. I'm thinking Little Hope is probably like maybe nine, eight or nine. You might be right. It might uh, be to me, Little these, Hope. These three games are all in They're the all succession that boat. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm thinking. Is that what we're thinking then? Little Hope, probably. Man of Medan. All right. All right. Yeah, I like that. I'd be game with it. Little Hope. We're not even fighting as much as I thought we would. Man, the I'm night's not over. Dennis argued with himself just for the first bit. <laughs> <laughs> I was just trying to be clear. And let's uh, talk about Man of Medan really quick for anybody that hasn't played it. That was it. the ghost ship. That was the ghost ship, and it had some good jump scares. It had some good jump scares. It just got a little. I feel like it wasn't very memorable. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like I think we got an okay we're like, ending. We're we're. Uh, Little, little hope. Little hope. Left at the end of it, we're like, there was more questions. What the fuck? Yeah. Was, yeah, yeah. Than answers at the end of, yeah. of that. And I, I know a much that, better story. Much I know some story. people would probably not appreciate that, but I liked it that it didn't kind of tie up everything at the end. It kept little hope over Man of Medan for me is story. Yeah. 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 Or anything. Story. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cuphead. <laughs> Cuphead, yeah, Cuphead would be number eight. No, it's not. No, no I would head there. You know what? I would not put Cuphead number eight. Where would you put it? I said not eight. <laughs> I would. See, we got to get rid of these so that I know what's left. Okay. Give them to me. Give them to Scott. What is left? Here's I'm my argument. Here. That's gone. Yeah. Here's my my argument on this whole thing, is. The music's really good, the art's really good, yes. the gameplay is fun and infuriating at the same yes. time, but my wife <laughs> ruined this fucking game for me, just like she ruined Friends. It was like, I don't want to watch the show anymore, Jen, and she's like, you're going to fucking watch the show because it's the best show ever, and then she names, you know, every line as they're, as they're doing it, they she'll I was challenged, tell you before the line. I was challenged to do a She wouldn't let me quit this. You wouldn't give me a break. I'm like, just give me a week. Just give me a fucking week where I don't have to be infuriated. And then... Yeah. And you you could see me... Shut up. 
You could see me like every time we played. My oh, fuse know. got shorter every time. <laughs> oh, I know. Every time, like we would be playing for like I think at the last gameplay I played for ten minutes and I fucking almost threw the controller and I was <laughs> done. I was <laughs> done. I was done. It's true because you you were I think you were just you were done with it. Do I was. I just needed a fucking break. Do you know what? Was just what? What did we play like maybe? Two weeks there, and I don't Shush. know if it was two weeks. I beat the game. Felt Shush. like two years. I can't even say I beat the game because I gave up. I was, I was Listen, so much done. Uh, Listen. Was, no, this is my time to get my my vent. <laughs> I can vent now because you wouldn't let me quit the game. I hate it there at the time. <laughs> it's two against one because any time Dennis would come over, I'd be like, let's play Cuphead, and Scott would say, fuck Cuphead. And you're like, oh, I'm on Cuphead. <laughs> and then you would want to play it too. Making but my life at miserable. At the end of every session, you'd be like, I fucking hate that game. I'm never I playing do, that again. I... And then you would want to play it again. I so hate the you game, but it's, it's so much fun. Yeah, I'd never, I'll never play it again. I loved it. I, never... I could she see me going back. She made me rage and... and I was done. I was Somebody so challenged done. me to do a speed run on one of these levels. I think they challenged us, and I, I think you told me about it. And I said, tell them to <laughs> fuck off. There's not, there's no way. No, they challenged me specifically. I, I will challenge anybody to see how far we can throw this game. Okay, <laughs> I think this is better than Overcooked. Oh wait, oh. I think. Yeah, it's... we still have Overcooked. I think I it's... liked Overcooked one better, and I like that. Really? I had more fun playing Overcooked number one than I did that. I think it's better than Overcooked. I couldn't I think finish it's the better game. Better than Warhammer Chaos. Baby. No fuck no, no fucking way. I would put it number six. I would probably put it higher if it wasn't for the fact that I hated it so much. See, I would have put uh, it thirteen there if it wasn't. I I would I might have Cuphead in my top five. That yeah. Fuck that's you what too. I'm Piece of shit there with. I know, but it's uh, we have to de designate it a number. Do we want to come back? What to are you this putting one? worse than that? See, for me at this point here, like number eight, I would probably throw in Overcooked. No, I definitely like to throw better than that. And that's saying a lot when I did I not rage. I okay. didn't rage quit Overcooked. Okay, so then can we put Chaos Bane number eight? Fuck no. <laughs> No? No! You liked it? That I liked much? it! Better than that! Okay, but then. It's we had. Did we. Just like playing Gold At Cup the end of it, we were like, you know, uh, it was kind of. The ending was kind of lackluster, but the whole time through, we played, we had fun the whole way through, and then at the end, it was like, oh, it's over. I know, but the only reason that we we hated Cuphead is because of Jen. It was still fun, but it was just so damn hard. It's good gen. And but yeah. how fucking amazing did you feel every time you beat a level? Oh, I almost died of a heart attack. <laughs> 37 times. I think Cuphead is higher than 8. Oh, I would have given it a 13. Where would you put it? I Was said it I'd probably... Put it in 5? Five? 5 or 6. I'm I would let it slide down to 6. Okay. I, I would let it slide down to 6. Okay, we're putting it in six. It's two against one. Fucking shit. Too bad. <laughs> and here is the downfall of the Retro Rivals. <laughs> <laughs> this is our last, last episode. Last, last episode of Retro Rivals. Get this thing in here. Why is it so loose? What do you have in here? It's just, a, it's oh, cards. Hurts. That's what it comes to. Can you, you want to put them up around the room? By the way. I blame Marcus for making my life. Thank miserable. you, Marcus! It was a Christmas gift to Jen. I loved it! I'm it was a love hate one. relationship. Yeah. <laughs> so we hate. already did Maden of Maden. <laughs> but Warhammer Chaos Bane. I just. It it, was... See, it's better than Cuphead! No. Oh, fuck yeah. No. <clears throat> I'm like, I, I feel this like. This is our enjoyment scale. The, the reason why we liked it so much is because we were playing all three together. Yeah, mm -hmm. but that's how we're ranking all of these. Yeah, yeah, but I know. But when I compare <clears throat> that against Dungeon and Dragons Heroes, <clears throat> that doesn't even fucking compare. And See, that's, that's what I'm looking at. I'm looking at the games that are left, and I'm and I'm saying. Well, you guys wanted to go this way. Better. I but know. You, you skipped it, a couple spaces. It leaves. <laughs> well, because we went. <laughs> Make up your mind. I don't know. I'm thinking Warhammer Chaos Bane and Overcooked go somewhere in here. I'm willing to put Chaos Bane at You know what? <clears throat> I mean, yeah. I think that is our number eight. 
probably we're, we're talking about it was just Ultimate Alliance 3. It had its issues. It was just too damn generic. There was nothing going on, you know what I mean? It was yeah. very forgettable, except like, for the first boss. Was Why so, it was so hard. Because we had the rest had of it was stupid easy, and no, then there was one other boss. No, I can't it remember. wasn't stupid easy. We did die, but uh, we had it set on a higher difficulty level when we first started it. Because I was like, we could probably do this. No, I think we played like full game on normal, and we had debated on dropping it oh, to easy because we struggled so much on that first boss. Oh, uh, I yeah. don't even remember who it was. Um, I don't know, but we were playing with uh, oh the. The Guardians, Guardians of the Galaxy, Galaxy. and I'm yes. like, oh, fuck. Yeah, we were, I was kind of losing my mind at first. But once we got I past once that, we got past that yes. and we started I, getting better characters, well, yeah, I was, then it was I fine. used Thor, I think, pretty much I pretty much used ever. Captain so America. So should I move Cuphead up to five so we can put no. Chaos No! I think shot. Marvel Ultimate Alliance goes number eight. I can't argue too much with that. Okay. I'm not writing that all Marvel. Just put Ultimate, Ultimate. Alliance. Mwah! 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 Okay, well, I mean, we're making progress. <clears throat> I'm excited for this next one. Uh, hunt down. Okay, but what do we do with Chaos? Baby? No, we're not there yet. Please, please. Hunt down! Hunt down! It was fucking good. Okay, Music. then, why don't we fill in number seven spot? What would you put at seven? Are you saying it's gonna be overcooked? Myself, it's it, well. It, to me, it's either overcooked or chaos. Or chaos thing. I'm not putting overcooked in my top five. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I have more fun with overcooked number one than I do with that. We had fun with that all yeah. the way through, but there was no wow factor. It we was weren't, at the end. we weren't laughing. We were like, we were in tears, laughing. Yes, yes, fine. I agree. Fine, we're talking. This is enjoyment. Fine, though. fine. Overcooked somehow makes uh, Dennis's top makes five. Makes it in my top. Well, five. <laughs> if we're being honest, Cuphead would have been five, and Overcooked would have been six, but we had to appease. I, Cuphead the shouldn't even War. be in the top ten. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is not gameplay graphics. You know what would have been, been funny? Anything. It's enjoyment, enjoyment levels. <laughs> this is the enjoyment list, and there's no way, no way Cuphead should be that high. Four games left. We got four games left. Uh, Dungeons and Dragons Heroes, Trinity Trigger, Hunt Down, and Guns Gore and Cannoli. We're on Hunt Down. What do you guys think? Well, let's let's do it this way. This is gonna kind of be a. What would you put at your fourth? Out of these four, what's your four? Because you just just name off the four that are left. We just did. I myself hunt down Trinity Trigger. Dungeons I would have hunt down, down at number four. Oh really? No. Uh, to me, it's a toss up between Hunt Down and Guns Gore and Cannoli. To me, they're they're guns, three and four. Guns four and Gore three. and Cannoli. Uh, it was great, but it wasn't. Long I'm almost enough. leaning Trinity Trigger. As number four? As number four? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Tell me what happened in the story. <laughs> tell me. What What was the story about? I know, but that's just because uh, we, when we're playing a well, game... Well, tell me what happened in the story. What was the story of Dungeon Dungeons Dragons Heroes? Well, fuck, we had to go kill a guy. Right? Well, yeah, we <laughs> killed a guy in Trinity <laughs> Trigger, too. We killed lots of guys. <laughs> I don't remember the whole details of it there, but there's Obviously one, like, not. <laughs> <laughs> I killed a guy. But like we were actually reading that. Yeah. It just didn't come into memory. Trinity Trigger, we were like, no, no. Just just start we first we put it on autoplay so they would talk and it would go through. Yeah. And then we were like, no, just skip through it because I don't want to fucking hear that anymore. We just wanna fight. We yeah. just wanted to fight, which to me was fine. Yeah. It was fine, yeah, but it we was We were like, making excuses to come play Trinity. I was making excuses yes. to come play Trinity. Uh, at the same I time. I wasn't making excuses to come play Hunt Down. Oh. Hunt Down was such a small experience and I and it was over very quick. We're what training. about Guns Gore and Cannoli for? Because it was short. Okay, well, like I like, put it number four. Because it was I, fun as hell. Like, it was really fun. The top four are all fucking great games. Hunt Down was a longer game than Guns Gore and Cannoli, I think. Yeah. And I just liked so are we the gameplay better. It, like, 
I, the music was better, you know, like, and just enjoyment wise. The way for you're me. saying that, if, if that's the case, does that mean Trinity Trigger and Dungeon and Dragons Hero are one and two? I, like, that's how I put it. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Okay, well. Number four, just based on the length of the game. Length of the game. I could have, yeah. And and I almost watched Dennis lose his fucking mind. <laughs> Like rage, first time I ever seen Dennis go to rage quit there. <laughs> a fucking rat boss. He was I was like, he was he was done, like really done. And then Jim wasn't letting us finish again there, and I thought it was because, gonna be the fucking end of a friendship. Because because <laughs> when you beat the level, there's this fucking excitement and this sense and of like I did it. Take it. Get there. <laughs> I did it. I don't know. I'm still playing Henry Hatsworth, and I can't get past that fucking thing. And I swear, yeah, to you're not allowed hours. to quit. You're not allowed I to quit. I won't quit. I won't quit. I won't. I'll beat it, and then I'll feel so amazing about it. So, Gunsborn can only hunt down is three. I think so. That's yeah. how I would put it. Um. Yeah. Shit. Trinity so, Trigger and uh, what we have left, Dungeons and Trinity Dragons. Trigger on the PS5, Dungeons and Dragons Heroes on the Xbox. Mm -hmm. Now, we can only... I, I think both games are in the same situation, like, because you played them. Yeah. Three-player co-op made it a lot better. Yes. Yes. Because, let's be honest, I mean, all... <laughs> all of these games, when we play together, we always we had have fun. fun. Yeah. We can take a shitty game and still have fun with it. There's no shitty games here. Yeah. Except Dennis hates Overcooked too. He just wants you to know that. Cup, but he's... Cup hits. Okay, don't oh. get out of Cup Head Brand again. Yeah. <laughs> we're not going We're then. done with Cup <laughs> we're, we're done. Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Personally, here's my here's my opinion. Yeah, we don't care about that. Why am I here? <laughs> Dungeons and Dragon Heroes is number one. That's my same opinion. Trinity Trigger was awesome, but it had flaws. Nobody else could access the menu, only you. You hated having to fucking go through and figure things out. Yeah. You usually throw that at Dennis. But I hated that we couldn't there easily was, do stuff in that. For a modern game, easy. that should have been no, figured out. Like, that's not even a big issue for me. The issue was there was, there was no fucking story at all. That well, I the story, the story that, was that there. The story was there. We just, we just wanted to kill people. Yeah. So we didn't bother with the story. Is no, what the problem? Like we was. tried to bother with the story at first, and it was just, it wasn't appealing. It wasn't. It was lackluster. Yeah. Either. The biggest yeah. flaw with this one was uh, lost progress. Sometimes, if we didn't save enough. The save points, and then also the oh, slow down. That's a typical. The slow down when you'd switch weapons or switch stuff. Like if somebody was going to switch but something, you're like don't do that. Yeah, I'm in the middle but of a fight. The, you, that's that's on us. That's not part of the game. That's, no, I know. Uh, I'm just saying. Well, this is all about somebody our experience, else, right? If three of us are playing. Somebody else has to hit the go into the the quick menu to switch weapon. It yeah. slows the whole thing down. Like uh -huh. that, that's part of the game. Yeah, yeah. It has to do. But that. I'm just saying, experience wise, that. Like that was a little bit of a ding against the experience of it. I'm just, I'm picking, I'm picking little fucking things because yeah, they're both because great. Because you have to decide. Well, I have yeah. to. But if you guys like Dungeons and Dragons Heroes as your number one pick, I'd be fine with that. I would probably put Trinity Trigger above it. Yeah. Really? I, Trinity Trigger, I really enjoyed. Like at the end, yeah. we were done with it there when we were fighting that beast, and it was. You're fighting for half an hour and you've literally Did taken. Did anybody notice we're pitting quarter. PlayStation against, against Xbox right now? Yeah, but because that's an exclusive. That's the only friggin' retro game we have in the whole collection. Here. Yeah, mm -hmm. thirteen. Mm -hmm. But yeah, uh, I mean those are our number one and number two games. And see, I f see when we when we finish Dungeons and Dragons Heroes, when we finish that, we f we finished. You know, we beat the boss. It was awesome. We. Finished this, the main story, and then we went and back. Then and then we just kept playing, and it was like there was actually there was way harder, better boss fights after the main story. To well, I mean, an we extent, could have done, we could have done them during the last bunch. Were tedious. that one last god? Well, we quit it. Oh my god! Well, we quit we it just quit because it. it's like ah. Uh, and then the fucking glitch where we couldn't get that last. Thing, 
There was a glitch where we couldn't get the last beast key. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that was kind of and that was up frustrating because we missed it during the main story. Yeah. yeah. Um, then there was the uh, there was some weird glitch. I don't even know how we messed it up, but remember we beat one. Oh, of those. I remember. What was oh. it? What was there? Five? No. I think it was f four. Four big bosses. No, I think it was five. Five, maybe. I think it was, it five. was five. Anyway, we regardless, beat, we beat two of them, and then we were trying to beat the, the third, third one, and we failed. And we said, okay, let's just call it a night. And then we no, I think we said, well, we oh no, something oh, happened. Something happened. We we yeah. loaded our game again. Yeah. And we, then well, we, we needed had to, do, to fight the yeah. second guy again because and was, oh. we needed to go get more supplies because we walked into that one with not enough yeah. health and yeah. stuff like that and we're like okay we'll configure our weapons so we'll just go to our lab yeah. we'll reload and when we did it didn't we didn't save the last fight for whatever reason for whatever reason yeah. which I thought we so did I think I was just a screw up on our part but but the last bunch of bosses is like fighting a tank with a BB gun. Yeah. Like yeah, just no, I wish I didn't want to fight. Long. I didn't want to fight for two hours. It's what it was against a, a boss for like no reward at the end. Yeah, because was the no game reward. was already over. Yeah, we might have gotten a better weapon. Yeah. Whoops so based based on solely on just the main story versus the main story. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Clear winner in my opinion. I'm yeah. okay with yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. This one was kind of it was kind of funny at times too. Some of the the people you would talk to. But how the heck does an Xbox game be a number one? I don't know. It was a you good, know what I mean? It's a very underrated, it's very, very underrated. good yeah. game. Yeah. It's got its issues where it is aged, you know, graphically, and then some of the mechanics going in the menus and all that stuff is not as quick and Yeah. Like I remember we were going in and we'd be like, oh well what if I buy this weapon? I can't we couldn't really tell Against the other weapon in our oh, yeah, it wasn't did. giving it to you right there. We had to jump back and forth. Into yeah, 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 yeah. Categories. It wouldn't tell you if, if your upgrade was actually going to help your stats or... Yeah. You can, I you like that we could, all, way we could all get into the menu yeah. at the same time. For certain things, not yeah. for all things. When we go to the merchant to buy stuff, we had to do that separately. But uh, I kind of wonder... This was a better Diablo. Kind of I think that's what we were looking was. for, yeah. yeah. We didn't even think about that with this. But uh, I kind of wonder the community that's watching what they'll have a problem with on this list. <laughs> You, 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 you got a problem? Come to Canada, eh? Yeah. <laughs> we'll say sorry. <laughs> well, yeah. We'll set yeah. you straight, then say I sorry. I think uh, Cuphead's going to be hard for people to see at number six. Oh, I can see. Yeah, like, there's no way Overcooked's better than that. I'm going yeah. by enjoyment. Enjoyment. And I think yeah. the devil in me being lower than Little Hope, because Little Hope is... Uh, to me, they're, ranking they're all... Ranking-wise... It ranks lower than in all of those. Uh, oh, I'm just going by what the enjoyment was. Yes. Yeah. Well, this is our list. So, yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter. But I just think people go, come in, the numbers, man. Like, what do, do you be... think that they would be higher or yes, lower? Yes, higher. higher. I it think would probably be it's higher. a. It's kind of a. And it would a probably have been higher me. if Jen, my wife would not have made me rage quit. So. Anyways, we beat it. I felt pretty good about it. Oh, yeah. We, we did well. Yeah. All I right. don't even think I have it on my list for games beat. You no, know, you didn't. You I, when we when I said because I didn't beat the by last. Just to be fair, guys, a couple of these Island games Hole. are are two player games. But what we would do is when someone would die, we would pass the controller. Or if it wasn't a if you die, hunt down, yeah, hunt down was like that. Uh, cup yeah, but we like kind that. of like hunt down Cuphead for sure. Yeah, we would kind of go with. Your frustration level that we couldn't beat yeah. it, but also okay, you're doing really good against this guy. You need to so me and yeah. Scott are gonna pass the controller yeah. back and hope that we, you know, we play well and fight the slack. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that's our list, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Scott, have a bitch fit about Cuphead. And. If you guys know of a good multiplayer game, yes, please. Oh, yeah. We have played a Let lot of Couch Co-op games, so chances are we may have played it, but 
for and our huge list. Yes, it. yes. Throw us some comments on uh, what we should try next. But couch co-op. Couch co-op. Yes. Not online. Uh, yeah. Local co-op. Right. Local co-op. Uh, we got three Local chairs here. This is what we're set up for. Exactly. All right, guys. Until next time, game on. Look, I finished my drink. I'm almost finished. Uh, it no was... clinging. I'm almost Diet Pepsi. Sponsored by Diet Pepsi. No, it's not. I wish it was. All right, that's it. I wonder if we would do that list again if we would get close. Don't even worry about the fucking list. That is... Stop it! Can't have nothing nice. I showed it on camera. <laughs> Did you sell the eraser again? <laughs> <laughs>